uh, for me it's uh, nice to go forward with my practice without any pressure or and uh, think about the financial thing i can do focus on my practice that is a good way with the residency i got patmini chitur as a mentor i'm very glad that because of i when i'm starting to movement practice uh, i am always watching her videos and uh, how they are doing very curious about to know that uh, finally uh, the I, i got mentor i'm very glad to that i showed what i did till now so i got so many clarity what i'm doing how can i go forward and that clarity will make more confidence and uh, yeah practice going forward what is uh, yes, martin suggest me some rhythmic rhythmic area when i am showing what i did yeah he is helping the way some rhythmic spaces yeah his suggestion is also very help for me for my experience as a physical object i am started some years back mm, i i work as in uh, trying to say in some uh, took subjects and issues i worked with that and with the body so one point i realized i want to say myself with my experience when i am thinking that uh, in my experience not only the body so object is there so i took objects and try to connect with the what i want to say like that practice going like that recently i did a production it's called nerpala so nerpala is a wooden plank it is used as a door is back in my villages so uh, that object uh, i took then i started to work with that then slowly make a production now uh, now i am this piece uh, from here the residency i am doing stone it's called stone so stone the object is came like, very naturally like when I, i have a hobby like whenever i go if i feel i want to do practices with movement i will do sometime i will record sometime i doesn't record uh, one moment i, I when my uh, friend home it's uh, his name is called ajit is in also kasaragod from kasaragod uh, near his house one river is there uh, very beautiful river uh, chullikara is in kasaragod so uh, it's like a rock in between the river we can travel in between and we can sit there like that this is a good place i went there i start to practice myself then uh, i just uh, took some stone is near so i took stone and just practice with that object slowly uh, when i it is touch it's like uh, some felt very good and i improvise it with that so it is i i think i can uh, Uh, make connection and go it forward then story the uh, the the piece the idea will come yeah now is a uh, now working in a stone <coughs> for me i understand when i am started with the object it's like uh, objects giving uh, so many movements what i can do they they will offer me so many movement vocabulary i don't know yeah movements exactly the the object will giving so many uh, movement ideas it's like uh, the composing the movement where to express myself the new way and new things yeah that's i am trying to 
it's uh, for movement i am not uh, think about i am going to be a contemporary dance it is started all is coming in naturally <laughs> when i am studying in acting i i did so many movement forms kalari kodiyattam yeah then uh, the way i like practice movement so slowly i i uh, then i went to art gallery for study one year the course from there i also i learned so many forms after the after that i started to practice myself no then i i started to uh, express myself by the movement here yeah, kind of the need to be go very beautifully till po- from a, from one point i thought don't need to be that like that because of for me i am not like that very the kind of my practice uh, my character or whatever it is so yeah relax and what it, what else come what ever come is just place it just look what will happen going to happen that's also very curious no i am also like to spontaneous things but why i can also watch the spontaneous things <laughs> see in the performance yeah